Is this... real? How can you define the boundary? Focus. You were sent to save them. We don't know where they are. We don't know how much time they have left. If you want me to save them, I have to know which doors lead where. You can't. I found one. Looks like I'm in a subway. Moving on. Roger that. Proceed with caution. Destination is unknown. Alright. Let's see where this leads. Inside a military base. Activating the map maker. Tell me what you can see. Busy out there. Stealthy approach advised. Too late. Listen up, Jack. Your mission is to infiltrate Selino Yask in the Soviet mountains, ensure the safety of Sokolov, and bring him back to the West. Your code name for this mission will be Naked Snake. I'll be referring to you as Snake from now on. The clock is ticking. This will be a sneaking mission. You must not be seen by the enemy. You must leave no trace of your presence. Is that clear? This kind of infiltration is the Fox unit special. In other words, weapons and equipment to procure on site. That goes for food as well. You're completely naked, just as your name implies. I have to find my own weapons and equipment? Whose crazy idea was this, anyway? The mission rests entirely in your hands. A real one-man army. <laughs> virtuous mission now. Dreams can no longer fool me. Never 
reality. I'm stuck somewhere between them. War, famine, destruction, death. The year is 20XX. Welcome to the future. The Forever Winter is a four-player sci-fi tactical survival horror shooter that takes place in a future where massive armies are skinning the bones of our once beautiful Earth. You are a scavenger lovingly referred to as a scav. Within this combat ecosystem, you assume the role of looter and survivor. Trapped between two warring military factions of the future, each with their own objectives. Outgunned, undersupplied, and constantly under attack, you must rely on cooperation and cunning to survive even minor enemy contact. Situational awareness is key in this world. Stop, look, and listen. Trigger discipline will save your life. A target missed is a bullet wasted, and not every battle is one worth fighting. Only kill what you can loot and get away with. Every time you open fire, you are ringing the dinner bell. Make it worth it. Welcome home, deep down in the guts of the city. Refugees seek shelter here, and they choose your level because you have one of the few things that matter. Water. H2O brings traders, shops, and allied mercenaries that have your six. If you want to survive, you'll need to pick up jobs from the two warring factions. Be smart about the jobs you take. The more a faction controls a sector, the more heavy units they will deploy, and the more dangerous it becomes. The more jobs you do, the more jobs you'll get, and the longer you'll keep everyone alive. No one gets by in this world all on their own. So don't be afraid to help others when you can. Donation stations are made available where high-level vets can share gear with low-level baby scavs. You were in their shoes once, too. Here you can customize your rig, an innovative modular platform that grants you advanced abilities. Pneumatic jump allows you to quickly traverse rough terrain and reach hard-to-get drops. Turrets allow you to shred, at least for a short time and scanners allow you to scout ahead to plan your route. You want guns? You've got them. Modify and upgrade your firearms for the jobs you take. Always remember, the more gear and ammo you bring in, the less you can carry out. So spec accordingly. Once you're kitted up, it's time to enter the macro city of Lost Angels. Megastructures meant to house millions lie vacant while automated underground factories churn out war machines by the minute. As the war rages and destroys the world by day, 
AI-driven machines nicknamed the Night Shift rebuild by night. Recovery units stalk the streets, dragging the wounded and the dead to be harvested for their organs. Learn your surroundings, avoid patrols, and maybe you can make it out alive. Every job has rewards and consequences. The details matter. Make sure to dig into the intel thoroughly before heading out. Missions may include sabotaging faction facilities, collecting debts, and good old-fashioned MDKs. No matter how easy you think the job is, don't get complacent. Things can change at the drop of a casing. If by some chance you find something of real value, you will be hunted, and the factions will send bosses that far exceed your fire team's capabilities. Take note of their weaknesses and plan your strategy to take them down. Even fully geared, it will require coordination, teamwork, and a bit of luck. There are only three types of scavs, the fast, the smart, and the dead, so don't be ashamed to retreat if the fighting gets too hot. Remember, there are no heroes here. Just a few men and women running around in the dark with half-empty magazines. Forever. this place tell me what do you want from me you have to remember who the hell are you how's your voice in my head can you read my mind reading your mind it is rather complicated to explain but i can use it to distinguish other voices i can't believe how you can access some parts of my thinking the invaders tried to transform you into a zombie but your immunity is substantial, and wouldn't have let that happen. I see things blurry. I can't remember. Hearing numbers, I couldn't get them out of my head. The most important thing to remember is who you are. Tell me your name. It's like a dream. You are surrounded by spaceships. Powerful bright light. The alien invaded the Earth. 2020 is not our lucky year. The virus has been spreading out of control supposed to be watching space. Instead, the governments were watching human activities. Did you know you were a professor and your project helped you achieve immunity from the alien's virus? I remember my name is Professor Korak. The surveillance program. You are the biggest whistleblower over the past several years. You must help humanity to find the cure. The idea is to travel with relatively primitive technological sophistication. This will enable us to engage in wars of conquest on a galactic scale. 
The Earth is now on the path of extinction, and we have to do something about it. Our mission is to destroy the aliens' devices cloning machine. I believe that civilization must be saved. We are far from our objective, but it can be achieved. I need you to help me break into my lab so I can search for the vaccine. Ready to save the world. Use grenades, let's go. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, okay. Get down <laughs> the second can <game> stand. <laughs>
nada. 